Today, I'm stranded on a desert for 100 days where the sun burns you, and with deadly wildlife, watch till the end to find if I can survive on this stranded desert. So on day one, I spawned in a hole and pretty much stayed there till it was night. Once it was night, I started exploring for anything I could use to survive. Like this mouse. Hey zombie, leave me alone. Hey mouse, mouse, come here boy. Come here boy. You ain't running away from me. While I was doing that, I noticed a desert temple and then a village right beside each other. Oh, okay, you know what? Oh, yo, yo. Pyramid, pyramid thing. Uh, oh, water. Oh my god. Oh, village. No way, no way. No, no, no way, guys. We are so lucky the village and then decided on staying there so day two started with me taming a camel and then i started waiting till it's night since it was impossible to move around in the day now once it was dark i started with going to check out the desert temple um how much we have but the moon is going down not good meaning we do not have much time but Then I went back to the village and I crafted a pickaxe and a helm. Then goofed around on my camel. Yo, we got a camel. Let's go. Let's call him Fred. Oh, oh, Fred. You good? Yeah. Hey, Fred, Fred has some problems going up stairs. Okay, there's a creeper. I do you not know, like creepers. Okay. But yeah, look at Fred. Look at Fred. Me and Fred dominate. Me and Fred. I'm just gonna put you in here. You're gonna be nice and safe, right? Cows, I know, I know he's a unit, okay? Fred is a unit between you guys, but say okay. On day 3 to 20, I go mining and get myself iron armor. Then I start building this giant wall all around the town and the desert temple. This took a long time and this is only the skeleton of the wall. Okay, so I was building the wall, um, I just found an eagle, or whatever the hell that's supposed to be. Just landed, it was just in the sky, and this thing, and it's growling at me. I don't think it likes me, I don't know what it is, but I think it's like a coyote or something. Now that I was finished building the bare bones of the wall, now it took me another 10 days to fully finish the wall. So from day 30 to 50, I know, a big jump. All I did was collect sand, build my house, and unfortunately the replay got corrupted when I was building my house, so I'm gonna just show you the finished product. So this is how it turned out, I think it looks pretty good, um, as you can tell there's a snake coming out of it because I'm trying to get grass to go in my backyard part of the house, so yeah. Day 50 I wanted to take Fred out and go on an adventure. The first thing we came across are these coyotes and then a village nearby. I deleted it or in other words, robbed them, but yeah, that was the end of day 50. Day 51, I got back on Fred and we kept exploring. We stumbled upon another village and we um, borrowed some items and in there there was a blacksmith and we got tree saplings, which was crazy because there was no trees on this desert, meaning now I could turn my own town into an oasis. Also, Fred got a cool carpet, look at it, he looking dripped out, huh? So day 52 to 61, I planted those trees I found earlier. And then I started collecting more sand and then patching all the holes on my land. I think it looks pretty cool that way. Also, there was this really creepy spider that crawled out of the cave and shot these arrows at me. Yeah, not fun at all. Not fun. So day 62, I decided to go strip mining for diamonds. With not much luck, I came out with two diamonds. Hey, diamonds. Yo, let's go. I'm talking about guys 
I craft a diamond sword in that. So day 63, I reorganized my loot in my house a little bit, and then went mining for dirt. Then I filled in my backyard a little bit, and that concluded day 63. So day 64 is pretty boring. All I did was collect sandstone for a build I'm planning on doing in a couple of days. So day 65 was the same as the previous day, but I used a cool technique to collect sand and sandstone more efficiently by mining out the sandstone and then placing the torches below the sandstone, making the sand fall. For day 66, I want to collect more sand, and I don't want to bore you with that, so why don't I tell you about my new public SMP I released called Blade C. A Java and Bedrock SMP, meaning your friends on Bedrock can now join in on the fun. This is an SMP with custom mushroom hats, and which you can obtain by killing these mushroom men. But who would ever want to do that to these cute little things? I will sort them all. Anyway, the IP is on the screen, and please join Blade MC Discord server in the description below. See you there. Back to the video. After collecting an absurd amount of sand, I started building a small pyramid on this empty piece of land. I thought it came out pretty cool. Then I started building a church or something, um, but we'll come back to that later. Then I started taking down the permit temple. Oh yeah, there's also this freaking spider that was inside the temple. What? On earth is that? No, 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 no. Guys, 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 guys. Oh my god, look at its eye! Has like an eyeball. Oh my god, it has like a big eyeball. So after I took down the temple, I made a small pyramid look cooler and even more finny. And then I started building the big pyramid, which took a long, long time. So day 75, I went mining mostly for dirt and I got myself into some close calls. Okay, so I think we've got everything under control. Okay. That was close. But um, that was pretty much day 75. So from day 76 to 80, yes, you can probably tell, more sand. And after the sand gathering, I fixed up the edges of my pyramid. then made this weird looking box connected to my house. I don't really know what I'm going to use it for, but for the meantime, it's Fred's house. So day 80, I actually decided to go mining for diamonds. I'm telling you, this took a long time. Like, I think diamonds may actually be more rare in desert biomes. Mind clues where I was, with no food, I had to turn on full chunks to find my base. When I found my base, I came back with 20 cent diamonds and I crafted diamond armor. Then I had to get food fast, so I took Fred and we went looking for a village to steal some wheat from. After we did that, I started working on some finishing touches of the town. I started with a front garden thing I wanted to do. now day 99 i know i know it's sad it's sad goodbye fred hope you had a great time and goodbye goodbye <laughs>